know the community has questions the neighborhood have lots of questions like okay girl you went to vacation in africa it's time to come back now back to work let's go chop chop have you moved to africa i don't know <laughs>
thingy going on here, no societal thoughts or whatever. But there, can't, there came a point where I was just not looking forward to the morning time. I'm like, please, can the nights be longer? Because it's like I wake up, go to work, 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 get tired, come back home. Like there was nothing to look forward to except the weekends and leave. Yeah, that's what it was coming to. Like I was so bored and i was like kind of sinking into depression especially since this covid started and it just added to my thoughts on, on things so i was like oh my goodness i was actually supposed to come to sierra leone um last year and then the lockdown happened i had already purchased a ticket and everything i cried I cried real tears <laughs> yeah but it was all it's all good you know um so yeah like I feel like there was nothing more to do like me I'm a very creative person I like different things to go on in my day not just go to work come back home sleep and start it all over again you know like while I'm here in Freetown Sierra Leone um maybe like I can go to the market in the morning come back I can go visit a friend come back I can go to the beach come back I can do my thing you know so like uh, my days are very diverse I like adventure that's why I've been going around taking pictures going to different places and oh, it's been fun it's been adventurous so now that I'm in my um, transition stage um, I'm just learning I'm observing I'm asking questions I'm taking notes I'm not trying to rush into anything because you know of course this is Africa I'm used to the American, you know, American system. Um, but this is not America. This is Africa. <laughs> yeah. So, like, I always got to have that mentality. Even with the currency, um, like, I will talk about that in another video with the Leons and all. Um, can you imagine that $100 is 1 million leons in this country so like that's a whole nother conversation for another day but yeah like i just love how diverse my days are like i love it i i really love it so like i just you know i'm just learning i am learning like even in terms of starting my own business and things like that i am learning i'm studying the market i'm over here you know it's a city i'm in the city of freetown so it's very crowded yes <laughs> it's very 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 crowded like everyone <laughs> everyone is here everyone is selling something everyone is trying to sell you something so yeah i moved to africa i don't know how long i'm gonna be here it's, it might be a year it might be two years it might be five years it might be ten years but i'm enjoying it for now and it was my own decision yes it was my own decision personal decision to come no one forced me or anything. I was inspired by the likes of like Woody Maya, Jasmine Ama, um, lots of other people. It's not just me that's doing it. Lots of people have been doing it. Like just go on YouTube and type in relocating to Africa, relocating to Nigeria, relocating to Uganda. Lots of people are returning back to their homeland. Um, you know, with different purposes, different visions and all that. Like I know I have my own purpose of being here and i'm you know seeing it every day i'm discovering it every day and it's it's just fun so yeah you might see me walking on P, uh, uh, pz yeah the business city pz abacha street you can say hi <laughs> don't be shy okay so yeah um yeah it's been fun so far it's been fun like um i am still in contact with you know my family back in germany of course and um, we talk every day like um someone was always asking me like okay um are you gonna have water are you gonna have a house i'm like dude really of course the house i'm in right now was built by my grandparents my grandpa and my grandma yeah and this is the house i was born in actually yeah so i'm surrounded with all this history and vintage and uh it's it's so cool it is so cool I have water, I have electricity, I have internet, I'm good, I'm cool, I'm straight, so yeah, so yeah, I'll be here, I'll be here for a while, I'm gonna rock with y'all, like, we're in, this, we're in this town together, okay, free tongue, we did this free tongue <laughs> together, okay, um, yeah, so yeah, 
feel free to ask me any more questions that you have. I'm open for questions. Um, I'm open for collaborations. If you want to do a video with me, sure. Hit me up. Go ahead, okay? Um, my Instagram will be on, in the um, description box. And yeah, and anything else? Um, yeah, I'm open for collaborations. Modeling, I love to, you know me, I love pictures, so I can model for you. Um, event speaking, if you want someone to promote your event or anything like that. You know, I'm a creative person. So anything like creative and things like that, modeling, fashion, events, speaking, engagement, just hit me up, okay? All right, so I hope that answers your questions. Drop your questions down below. Um, please like, share, subscribe, comment, and you know, just feel free, okay? All right, so God bless you. Have a great day. So if you see me, stop asking me, who say you go back? That means when are you going back? I'm not answering you because that means you didn't watch my video. You ask me that question, I'm going to send you this video, okay? Oh, <laughs> that was so awkward. <laughs> Alright, so thank you. Thank you for watching. God bless you. Bye.